Hello, I'm Ayar Palki. I'm the CEO of Saragon Networks. We provide backhauling solutions for mobile networks worldwide, and we carry tons of data traffic in almost all locations around the world in between base stations. Hello, Ira. Thank you for joining us today. Could you start by introducing Saragon Networks to our viewers? Saragon Networks is the number one leading provider of backhaul solutions which are links, microwave links, in between the different cellular towers worldwide, which carry all the data between the towers back to the backbone of the network. We sell that equipment uh, all over the world, and we develop our own technologies all the way from the ground up, from chipsets until full systems, which uh, push the envelope of the technologies that enable very uh, efficient and cost-effective solutions for the mobile operators. In recent interviews, you've said that the role of the vendor is to help operators with their low profitability. Could you share more of your opinion on that? I think that if you look at the profitability of mobile operators worldwide, one of the issues they have is how do they pass more and more data at the same cost points that they are doing today. Because their business models move from carrying a lot of voice to a lot of data and a lot of bandwidth. Our solutions that come into that play enable them really to push the envelope and carry a lot more data. This way provide a lot more services uh, to their clients and us really, the users, and through that really gain an increase in both profitability and the revenue streams, which will allow them uh, to increase their profits. What is holistic head net hauling? Well, this is health net hauling is first as a tongue twister. It's harder to say than really to implement. It's really what we are calling our architecture for modern mobile networks carrying a lot of data, which is both a very difficult slogan because the networks are being very, very difficult. There are a mixture of a lot of technologies on the networks. Uh, from LTE, from coordinated LTE, from CRAN, from front polling, from CPRI solutions, from Wi-Fi, from Wi-Fi offloading, Wi-Fi 2.0. It's a lot of technologies the mobile operators are trying to use to really solve the data problem and the access problem. Our holistic headnet solutions that come in that really sit in the back of those, all of those types of base stations from small cells to macro cells, and hold all of that information in a holistic way back to the core of the network. What do you see as the future for headnets? I think that we are just starting the cycle of building headnets uh, out there. If I look at our mobile uh, customers worldwide, are just playing around and starting with different experimentation around head network networks. You have to remember that most of the networks that are out there today are very holistic, 3G, 3G and a half, 3G++ types of networks. Even early implementations of LTE were very uh, homogeneous types of networks. And the operators now are playing with different technologies in different places around the world in trying to build and understand what will be the architecture of the future networks. Some call it advanced LTE, some call it 5G networks, 4.5G. But the networks are advancing because the pressure from us, the users, to carry a lot more data is out there and will deliver uh, requirements for both backhauling and the access piece. That was very interesting. Thank you for sharing with us. Thank you very much.